because I'm sexy. Oh yeah, and you're sexy and you're beautiful. <laughs> so Colin, what about me makes me your I think you're daring, you listen when I say what I say. And you're always down with the cause. Like, I feel like you're not afraid to take chances. Even if you don't think it's the move or you think it's ugly, you're like, okay, I trust you. When did you knew that you wanted to work with me long term? I think it was our first fashion week. We made like major headlines. And that's when I knew I was like, this girl can really wear clothes. Yeah. And they don't wear her. And that's Ooh. what I've always wanted in a muse. I feel like I don't have like the model type body. This body is not meant for a size two and we always make it work all the time. We have a rule. <laughs> when it comes to wearing clothes, it's hair, makeup, and body. You gotta give, but then it won't work. I think we get that. Mm -hmm. What do you think is our most iconic carpet moment? Met Gala with Tom Brown. And I think it also broke you into another level mm -hmm. of the fashion world. People who didn't take us serious at first, we're like, okay, they are here to stay. Period. Seeing the dress after four years, staring at it is like, wow, you feel so much sweat and tears. Blood, sweat, and tears. Yeah, yeah. I, I think that day was really stressed out. Because we didn't fit that look until that yeah, morning. That morning. And if you see the dress in person, it literally like the size of a queen size bed. Like it's so big, it's so grand, it's so beautiful. No cap. No cap. In my bed. In my bed. What do you think keep us so consistent and elevated? I think that there's a chemistry there that like you you cannot buy. It took some trial and error to figure out what works for us. Yes. As far as elevation, I think it's a mixture of us, patient, and the team. And sometimes I have ideas and she's like, no. And sometimes she has ideas and I'm like, no. I think the fact that we're able to be really honest with each other. What else would you like us to achieve in the fashion space? I don't think we've reached the ceiling, but I would say the main thing for me is the CFDA, yeah. Fashion Icon Award. I think it's time. It's deserved. It's deserved. Give it to the dog. We've definitely created major moments. We have disrupted the space. Like I feel like we caused a cultural shift. There were not really many women like Hardy that existed in the fashion space. And I think that we were able to create our own narrative. My goal is that I want to reach a super stamp. It's not like, it's like, oh, but you know what? They're so young. Yeah, we young and doing it. We work our asses off. This wasn't easy. We got rejected so many times. There were shows that we only dreamed to be in and we're here. Yeah. That's that too much? No. <laughs>